differential reinforcement is when we reinforce a behavior but not another one. Doesn't make sense, right? <laughs> like, what are you talking about, dude? Um, it, <laughs> hmm. How many of you ever tried it to weld with a stick welder going, so if the stick's sticking out here and you weld, I don't know if you can see this, maybe you can. So you go, I think I did it wrong. I think you're supposed to go, all right? So differential reinforcement, if you weld one way, right, with a stick welder, if you pull it or push it, you're gonna get different effects. And it's gonna happen, it, one way is going to produce a hot weld. One way is going to produce a cold weld. One way is going to put a whole bunch of material in there when you may or may not want it. And then, to make matters even worse, switch yourself over to a MIG welder or a TIG welder and you've got to do everything differently. Well, in order to produce the reinforcers of having an effective, nice, penetrating weld that's strong, then you have to change your procedure. You're differentially reinforced. If I engage in this behavior doing this direction, it's going to produce reinforcers. If I do it the other way, it's not. Differential reinforcement. So back to shaping. Differential reinforcement is what you use. Say, this is the behavior we want at this time. We're going to change that to a different response and reinforce that one next time. Differential reinforcement.